Hi guys, welcome to Tune Basics, the series that teaches you how to play the basics. Today we'll be looking at how to play that famous song, The Old Lang Syne, on the tin whistle. This song was originally a Scottish folk song, but was made popular by lyricist Robert Burns in 1788, and it's commonly sung at New Year's Eve parties. Here is a penny whistle. This penny whistle is in the key of C. But don't worry if yours isn't in the key of C, because for this lesson, it is the finger holes that are important. When holding your penny whistle, remember that your left hand is positioned closest to your mouth and uses fingers 1, 2, and 3 to cover holes 1, 2, and 3. The right hand is positioned so that fingers 4, 5, and 6 can cover holes 4, 5, and 6. For these lessons, when you see a blue arrow pointing into the mouthpiece, this means blow gently enough to still produce notes. When you see a red arrow pointing into the mouthpiece, this means blow a bit harder to produce a higher note. So let's get straight into it. Here's what the old Lang Syne looks like when it's written down in the key of C. And here is how it sounds. C, F, 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 A, G, F, G, A, G, F, F, A, C, D, D, C, A, A, F, G, F, G, A, G, F, D, D, C, F. D, C, A, A, F, G, F, G, D, C, A, A, C, D, D, C, A, A, F, G, F, G, A, G, F, D, D, C, F. Let's take a closer look at phrase one. Cover holes one to six with fingers one to six and blow gently once. Cover holes one to three with fingers one to three and blow gently three times. Cover hole one with finger number one and blow gently once. Cover holes one to two with fingers one to two and blow gently once. Cover holes one to three with fingers one to three and blow gently once. Cover holes one to two with fingers one to two and blow gently once. And practice this until you end up with something that sounds like this. For phrase two, cover hole number one with finger number one and blow gently once. Cover holes one to two with fingers one to two and blow gently once. Cover holes one to three with fingers one to three and blow gently twice. Cover hole number one with finger number one and blow gently once. Cover holes one to six with fingers one to six and blow a bit harder once. Cover holes one to five with fingers one to five and blow a bit harder once. And practice this until you end up with something that sounds like this. For phrase three, cover holes one to five with fingers one to five and blow a bit harder once. Cover holes one to six with fingers one to six and blow a bit harder once. Cover hole one with finger one and blow gently twice. Cover holes one to three with fingers one to three and blow gently once. Cover holes one to two with fingers one to two and blow gently once. Cover holes one to three with fingers one to three and blow gently once. Cover holes one to two with fingers one to two and blow gently once. And practice this until you end up with something that sounds like this. Phrase four, cover hole one with finger number one and blow gently once. Cover holes one to two with fingers one to two and blow gently once. Cover holes one to three with fingers one to three and blow gently once. Cover holes one to five with fingers one to five and blow gently twice. Cover holes one to six with fingers one to six and blow gently once. Cover holes one to three with fingers one to three and blow gently once. And practice this until you end up with something that sounds like this. Now phrase five is exactly the same as phrase three, so let's move right on to phrase six. 
Cover holes one to five with fingers one to five and blow a bit harder once. Cover holes one to six with fingers one to six and blow a bit harder once. Cover hole one with finger one and blow gently twice. Cover holes one to six with fingers one to six and blow a bit harder once. Cover holes one to five with fingers one to five and blow a bit harder once. And practice this until you end up with something that sounds like this. And phrase 7 is exactly the same as phrase 5, and phrase 8 is exactly the same as phrase 4. So let's try putting all the phrases together. And there you have it. So thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And don't forget you can also follow me on Facebook or Twitter. And come and join us on Circle of YouTubers if you're a content creator like me. And until next time, stay tuned.